Hi guys, I can't get too close to this guy. It's Gromit. He's a, a true feral cat. If I get too close to him, he will do one of two things. He'll either attack me or he'll run away. But I've just noticed, just now, he thinks I'm sneaking up on him now. Well, I am, actually. Don't worry, Gromit. He's got dreadlocks. You see? There. And it's the same or worse on the other side, actually. It looks as though he's started to cast his fur. Because we haven't had it, we haven't had a winter really. We haven't had any cold weather. So I've noticed that a number of the long-haired cats, they're they don't know what to do with their fur. I mean, it's obviously a kind of natural reaction to grow the fur longer and thicker, or get rid of it. But how I'm going to get this off him, I've got absolutely no idea. It can cause pain when it becomes all tugged up like that. Uh, I can't touch him. Hey, you! He's been caught once, which, uh, to be neutered in a trap, which has obviously tainted his view of humanity because he's the only cat that I know who is completely untouchable really really feral a bit dangerous stop bumping me you yeah stop it stop it stop it don't you're making it shaky calm I'm really quite surprised he's letting me get close to him like this. He's absolutely huge as well, so I don't fancy taking him on. He's the biggest cat who comes here. I think you might have seen that video. He's about 12 and a half kilos. Yes, kilos, not pounds. He's a brute. He's nice, as you see. I think he's even quite nice to the other cats. I don't remember ever having a problem with him, with the other cats. I don't know if he's sick. Does he look sick to you? I hope not. That's a real problem if he's sick. Ah, uh, no, Baron is the same. We can't touch Baron at all. Um, and he does look sick. Baron's very thin. Sleeping beauties. So my boy, I don't know what we're going to do with you. Alright guys, any suggestions, send them in, written on a 20 euro note please. Cheers for now, bye.